What is up everybody, Hoosier Pulls here today. Thank you so much for joining me on the channel. I truly appreciate it. Today is one of my favorite days of the year. It is Top's finest release day and I had to go to my LCS and pick up a hobby box of Top's finest baseball. So we're gonna review this, see what kind of value it has and hopefully hit some great cards. So without further ado, let's get into it. All right, everybody, here we go. 2023 Topps Finest Baseball. This is one of my favorite sets. This set has been around uh, since the early 90s. Uh, I feel that it was one of those sets that kind of propelled um, baseball trading cards into the modern era. It's a really fantastic design. Uh, you get one master box, which is this right here that consists of two mini boxes. You get two autographs. Uh, it's like a hundred card checklist, so a pretty small checklist, which is a big pro for me. And this sells for anywhere around $220 to $240 uh, right now. So it is a little bit pricey. That would be one of the cons. You know, the price is, is pretty steep, um, but we're gonna see if the value is there. Uh, the autograph checklist is pretty solid this year. Um, pretty happy about it. Good amount of rookies. Uh, as well as you know superstars and veterans so here we go 2023 tops finest thanks so much for joining me today i truly appreciate it if you haven't uh subscribed yet hit that subscribe button i'm always doing uh video reviews opening products i love tops finest so much tops finest parallels are some of my favorite the rose golds are incredible um you know the golds look incredible so here we go we are due to get I believe it's like on per mini box is like two parallels and then one autograph. So here we go. The design is pretty standard. As you can see, there's a pretty big print line right there on that Corey Seager. Uh, but what I've seen so far, the quality control is really nice. We got Cade Cavalli. We are looking for Adley Rutschman and Corbin Carroll. And here's our first parallel. We have a Cal Mitchell. This is like the blue vapor, I believe, to 250. So we'll get Cal Mitchell on the stand. So first hit is a rookie parallel. You know, can't really complain. Again, the parallels, like I said, I love these. They look absolutely fantastic. Um, I really think that the refractors look great as well. We have a really nice Juan Soto, followed by a Paul Goldschmidt. All right, next pack up. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know what you think of the price point, what you think of the design. I love hearing your guys' input. We have Ruiz. We have Jazz Chisholm. We have a really nice Ichiro, like a throwback, headliners. That's a really nice card. Josh Young, rookie. That's pretty solid. And Joey Manessas, base rookie. So still looking for the auto out of here. I'm personally chasing Adley Rutschman and Christopher Morell. I haven't seen too much Christopher Morell pulled uh, from some of the early openings. So he seems like kind of a tough hit so far. We got Miggy. There we go. Christopher Morell. My guy. We're putting him on the stand. We got a Jose Altuve refractor. All right. So we got a refractor Jose Altuve, a Christian Yelich, and Freddie Freeman still looking for that elusive autograph. This pack feels pretty thick, but I kind of like the format. I think the format's kind of cool. You're guaranteed an autograph in each one. We got Shohei Otani. We got Lennon Sosa from the White Sox. We have Ketel Marte. Green. This is a crazy looking parallel. 53 out of 99. So we'll get him sleeved and put him on the stand. All right, next up, we got a nice Riley Green rookie and Oscar Gonzalez. Two packs left coming down to the wire there is a there's a pretty nice checklist um nice mix of rookies we got michael toglia we got mookie betts finest headliners the machine albert pujols shout out houdini sports we got hunter green and austin riley all right i hope the autograph is in this last pack let's see Hopefully we get a parallel. Looks like we got something a little bit shiny back there. We got Simeon Woods Richardson. Another Cal Mitchell. Who do we got? Trey Turner, Refractor. 
we have a green. Who is this? Josh Smith rookie from the Rangers. On card auto number 299. And Corbin Carroll right behind him. And that Corbin Carroll looks really, really nice. So we're going to sleeve up Josh Smith and Corbin Carroll and get him on the stand. All right, so there we go. Let's get into our second box. Not a terrible first box. You know, um, it's, it's all about the number of, you know, dart throws that you get essentially for pulling a big rookie, you know, or a big auto. Um, but this is kind of what I expected. You know, I kind of expected a Josh Smith, you know, type player auto. You know, but there are some really, really nice, you know, big ones in here. There's the dual autographs. But, um, you know, I I'm kind of expecting... Oh, wow. I believe it's Brian Bello. Red. Numbered to 10. Wow. That is nice. Red Sox rookie pitcher. It is the red and black parallel, I believe. And that is crazy looking. Wow. That is fantastic. So, Brian Bello out of 10. We have Wilson Contreras, Oswald Peraza. And could you imagine if that was like an Adley or Christopher Morel? But, I mean, still, that's... I mean, to hit a card out of 10, that is crazy. And a rookie as well. We got D.L. Hall. Ketel Marte. We got Anthony Rizzo. Nice refractor there. Brandon Crawford. And Nolan Gorman. All right. So, I mean... I will take it. I think that's that's pretty solid. You know, for the the price, you know, I do expect um, you know, like two parallels per box. Um, two hundred and like forty dollars is is pretty steep. We have a Luis Robert refractor, you know. So and we have a Buddy Kennedy Arizona Diamondbacks autograph. All right, and then Julio and Garrett Mitchell behind him so we're gonna get buddy kennedy sleeved up all right so there we go so kind of what i thought for autographs you know nothing too crazy um but you know we still do have you know a chance at, at pulling a nice rookie parallel i mean we already did the brian bella we got nolan arenado headliners that is a sweet card we got shay Langleers and another brian bello two packs left let me know what you guys think uh i feel like i'm pretty happy overall with the box um you know it's not the players IPC but I think all the color that we got um, you know a auto to 99 is pretty solid we got a Bo Bichette 102 out of 300 nice little color match there that is sweet and then we got Michael Harris and Nick Prado so last but not least give this video a thumbs up if you've enjoyed it so far I've had a blast we have Leover Piguero rookie Luis Castillo, Oscar Colas, rookie refractor, Carlos Correa, and Bryce Harper. All right, let's recap really quick. All right, so here is our base. Uh, we got quite a bit of base. You know, there's only 100 cards in the checklist. Uh, we did hit the Corbin Carroll base rookie as well as Christopher Morales, so that was pretty nice. Uh, we got a decent amount of refractors. That's also a... Uh, a nice uh, addition to these boxes. You got a rookie Oscar Colas, you know, some nice uh, stars. We got the headliners inserts, which are really, really nice. I really enjoy these. These are really sweet cards. And then the hits, we got this really nice Bo Bichette color match, 102 out of 300, a Cal Mitchell rookie to 250. We have probably the best card out of the box is this rookie Brian Bello number five out of ten that is pretty nasty and we have Ketel Marte numbered out of 99 it's a really nice like green vapor we have this Josh Smith rookie auto out of 99 from the Rangers and then Buddy Kennedy from the Arizona Diamondbacks I've had a blast let me know what you guys think thanks so much for watching I truly appreciate it we're gonna keep growing keep making videos and until next time we'll see you later